If you are a buyer and your realtor isn't doing a good job, this video is for you. So here's the situation. We had somebody that we knew on Instagram that reached out to us and asked us a few questions in regards to purchasing a home. Now, what they revealed to us is that they were working with another realtor and they were working with another lender. Now, here is where everything kind of broke down. So as a licensed realtor, I wanted to ask the proper questions in order for uh, me to, I guess, make suggestions uh, properly. So one, I asked if they have a written agreement with this particular agent. Did they sign anything stating that they chose them to be hired to help them look for a home, get a loan, do everything that is needed in order for them to get a home? Now, as Drain and I have kind of evolved in this aspect of the business, we've always, always had a agreement between the buyer and uh and us and before we even start looking at homes so once the consultation happens if they liked did ever and agreed with everything that we wanted to do as far as uh the buying process we had them sign the agreement after the consultation so since there was nothing in play it was open game now in order to level the playing field i did tell them to reach out to their realtor and to their lender and let them know like hey Give them a last ditch effort in order for them to kind of get their get back in their good graces and no response so they felt like they were just being neglected and uh, because of the lower price point they just felt like they needed somebody that was going to work with them for them no matter what that price was so what we end up doing the first thing we did consultation was already over we've already built in a value they we agreed with our strategy and we move forward the one thing that we did, first thing that we did, was get that particular hiring agreement signed. So now they've chosen us to help them represent them in order to purchase a home. Now, after a few weeks of looking at homes, they went to go take a look at a few. Uh, I gave them my critiques, but also, you know, wanted to see if any of these other homes checked their boxes. Now, the great thing is um, the home that they actually really, really liked went off the market and it was already pending. But what's funny is keeping in contact with that agent that knew that I knew that my client actually liked it. I actually kept in touch with her and uh, she actually enlightened me and told me like, hey, this home that they actually like is coming back on the market. Do they want to submit an offer? Um, and of course, my clients were super excited. So here's the thing. We were able to negotiate as much as we could. They were able to pay up a, a large portion of um, our fee. And um, we were able to negotiate them to go fix a certain amount of things. Now, mind you, this is an FHA loan. And with an FHA loan, they need to get those things fixed if, if, it's a very key word, if the seller wanted to choose that particular buyer. And we were able to do it. They were able to get it fixed. They were get they able to get all the section one cleared out like they said they were going to do. Um, and also get a few other items fixed that were not on the list. On top of that, we were actually able to get them a little bit of credit as well. So again, mind you, during this time, um, they are receiving offers. So it's like that was very, very, very key. And knowing the timing, knowing exactly when to submit the offer, knowing exactly what to negotiate. Um, and again, I built so much rapport with the agent. She was perfectly fine with everything as long as she negotiated, um, you know, her rate, my rate. Um, and we were able to have the seller take care of a few items and seller was happy buyer was happy and uh, you know we were able to close a chapter in uh, our new client's book about purchasing a home the, uh, the struggle was very very real for them and you know in conclusion um, happy client right um, taking one bad situation and turning it into something very very positive strictly keeping our eye on the prize which is making sure that the client is given the best service and uh, terms as well as price that they're willing to accept job well done on to the next one.